My name is Brad Lockhart and I am a graphic designer and I created the new unofficial Bellingham flag. Creativity isn't just for artists, it's for everyone. I think a big part of this flag is, is the storytelling aspect of it, how it tells the story and the history. I think that helped make it become a solution, the story behind it. So I think when you're solving problems and when you're trying to mediate, you just have to use your imagination sometimes. And, and, and a lot of it is compromise too, right? Like I had to make compromises with this flag. I had to take off elements that I thought were, they were pretty, but maybe they were overcomplicating things. And that's a big part of peace building is compromise and really boiling things down to problem solving, which is, you know, central to, to visual identity and brand. Collaboration was important because this flag needed to live a lot of places and it needed to coincide with a lot of people's visual identities. The visuals on the flag bring together the diverse aspects of our community because they talk about particularly our history and our geography, but as much history as I could cram into one flag. The flag has four main components. It features a blue half circle that represents Bellingham Bay, two white four-sided stars that represent the local Salish people, which is the Lummi Nation just to the west and the Nooksack just to the east. Uh, it has three wavy lines, which are a symbol of the word Whatcom. Um, which is, the definition of Wacom is noisy waters, and it also represents the place name that the Nooksack people gave to the mouth of Wacom Creek. Um, it has four stripes, which represent the four original towns of Bellingham, so north to south, that is Wacom, Seaholm, Bellingham, Fairhaven, who all came together to form Bellingham in 1904. And a lot of people like to fly the flag vertically, and when you do, the wavy lines become a depiction of Whatcom Falls itself. I think visual identity is extremely important. People haven't really ever had a way to say they love Bellingham before. There hasn't been something simple and geometric and relevant and clean that can live so many places. I, I really see it as my goal to try and improve the visual identity, use the skills that I have um, to make everything look better.